did have an agreement and you had met with city staff. What happened in between that, that this is all of a sudden changed? It, and, and I we have we have I, I honestly don't know. I mean I, I think we would have to ask ask the mayor that, but we actually met with the city this morning and um, they had a meet, they will have a meeting later on this afternoon because I think this may have taken them a little bit by surprise. So, so is that is that true? I mean you you had worked with IT department and things had were moving along mm -hmm. smoothly. Yes. Yeah. And then So we had we had the, the meeting this morning was just to to talk about, you know, the the agreement one last time and then to talk about um, the procedures, what would happen at the um, formal meeting this coming Tuesday. Yeah. And so we we brought up the comment that that had been cited by, by the mayor in the Gazette, as a matter of fact. So, okay. and they hadn't seen it. So we're going to regroup, and they'll either call us later on today or, or you know, tomorrow. Okay. okay. I you know I just think you have to. Understand. This mayor has made it pretty clear he's um, he's pretty committed to trying to help out some of the blighted areas of town. Right. And so you know, that, that I think he's done a lot of work uh, with urban renewal in that mm -hmm. regard. So it just seems to be sort of a theme of what he's doing right now not class warfare, but where we're going to expend public resources is going to be where we need them the most. Right, so that's, right. that's kind of right. what's that, that, right. that, I think that's the, I think that's what you've run into in Colorado yeah. Springs. Well, and the irony, honestly, from our perspective is that, uh, could, I don't know if you all around, we actually, back in the days of, of Quest, took a run at getting a cable franchise here and came pretty close. There was one thing that broke the deal and then our chairman decided we were going to be out of that business. So that ended that discussion. but. What is, is a bit frustrating for us is we're actually going to be the fourth entrant, facilities-based. And for whatever reason, Falcon has a no-build franchise. They are in a certain segment of, of the city. They have no build requirement whatsoever. And same thing with Porchlight. That's what we're asking for. You, you've set the precedent of having a no-build franchise for two other providers. Comcast didn't fight them. I, this feels like we're being singled out, and I understand there's been a change in leadership in the city, but I'll tell you, the fact that you, as a city, granted two other no-build franchises feels not being very business-friendly and targeting one new entrant. So, 